So I want to embed this Google form in the description of a YouTube video. So what I'm going to do is I need to get the URL of this YouTube video. So I just click view live form and I'm going to copy this URL. And we're going to use this as an assessment after a short YouTube video. So here I'm just at YouTube. Um, I'm going to click on my channel here. And I'm going to go to videos. And let's say that this is the video that I would like to um, add a link to the Google Form after. So I'm going to click info and settings. And here, right in the description, I can paste a link to that Google Form. Um, I don't need to do anything to make it a link. As soon as I hit save changes here, it'll turn that into a link. So I save changes. I can just hit this back button to see how it looks for everyone else. So now I have a link to that assessment there, so I could put short little directions for my students and then have a link to an assessment after this uh, YouTube video. So, in order to share this with um, my students, the YouTube video, I'll just click on the share button and I would just copy that link there and paste that either on your website uh, or send it to them in, e in an email. And I'm just going to jump back to that Google form real quick. I don't need that one. Here I'm editing the Google form. Um, this button right here that says view responses, if it, this is the first time you've ever clicked on that button, it'll say choose response destination. I mean, it'll, it'll make you choose a new spreadsheet, um, but when I hit this view responses here, or get resp choose response destination, um, it'll bring you to the Google form results in a spreadsheet. So that is um, a very quick walkthrough of how to um, put a Google form assessment at the end of a YouTube video and share that video with your students.